well, <laughs> hello Sunday. It's another Sunday concert. I don't even know if I've had a Sunday concert yet, but I'm going alone for real this time. I'm like kind of nervous about just because I don't really like this venue, but I think it'll be okay. I originally did have people to go with me, but um, the last minute, you know, life happens. So I will be solo, solo trekking it to see TV Girl at the Aragon Ballroom today. It's about one o'clock right now. I'm mostly just like doing normal Sunday activities, like picking up, cleaning, drinking a bubbler, and yeah, trying to just be chill and trying to be excited. I can't decide if I want to like go take myself out to dinner or get a drink or something, but I think I kind of want to just be sober also because it's a Sunday and I do have to work tomorrow, so I think it's the best thing to do. Probably just roll up when... Um, the show is about to start and go from there i'm excited i think but yeah <laughs> it's been an interesting couple of days i feel like i like just have been on kind of an emotional high and i'm sad i'm sad i'm going alone because i really like tv girl and i'm really excited for like that part of it but yeah i'm bummed i will be only going to experience this alone <laughs> but that's that's what's up welcome to the tv girl concert vlog starting now it looks like a gorgeous day out today at least so that's cool but yeah let's i'll, I'll bring you along when i actually start doing some something with myself like getting ready because right now i'm just Processing going alone. Here goes nothing. <laughs> this is the real deal now. Trying to figure out what to wear. I mean, I don't know. Uh, kind of want to be cash, but also kind of want to be cute. Now listen to the music. To my and my bed. So fucking cute. Okay, what am I wearing? What am I wearing? Like graphic T wise. Not yours. Bum, 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 bum. <sighs> Maybe I'll do the Rico t shirt because it's kind of like random. Yeah. That's that's gonna be it. Hang on. Yeah, absolutely fucking lovely. Here we go, shirt with the fucking Tommy jeans. I need to obviously just brush my hair out, put a little face on, but this is gonna be the, the fit for my solo adventure. This Eve. I'll make it, it'll be fine. Everything is gonna be fine. <laughs> mm. Alrighty. I um getting ready to actually leave I put my shoes on <sighs> okay so yeah I'm basically just gonna go grab a drink I think make my way to the show and just <laughs> roll with the punches. This is not what I thought this would be, but hopefully it's still fun. Wish me luck. Here we go to uh, TV Gail. I look, you just kind of want to get dessert. So I hope they have desserts here where I'm going and hopefully they just have like a bar seat I can go to because yeah, I might 
try and throw on a little eyeliner or something too quick before I go, but this is it.
trick. You know we couldn't leave the stage without doing everyone's favorite song tonight. It's the one you've all been waiting for, so get out your phones, start recording. It's about to happen. Get out your phones. Let's do it. It's about to go down. Go ahead, Wyatt. Get started. day uh, I did it I went to a show alone and was it worth it yes would I do it again out of choice no <laughs> I just enjoy having that shared experience with somebody being there with me call me crazy but I get it, like it's nice to not be able to worry about anybody, but like when a good song comes on or there's a hype lyric and you just want to like turn to someone and sing it to them or share that hype, like I didn't get to have that. It was just me hyping with me. But overall the show was really good. If you heard those clips, there was a lot of annoying people around me. Like if you're coming to a concert just to talk, Maybe like go to the bar or something. There's plenty of other places to just catch up. Besides the show, like while it's happening. Um, and there was also a lot of children at this show, which was kind of also different than what I was expecting. I didn't realize there'd be so many kids, but I guess they kind of had their TikTok pop off, which is weird because I've been listening to them since like 2016, 2017. So I thought that that was an interesting like dynamic to it all but <sighs> I can't believe I uh, went to a show by myself especially at the Aragon that place is huge and like the picture of the crowd that they put on their Instagram let me I don't want to like do a whole thing but I'm sorry this crowd do you see this I was like right here right next to sound um, that's crazy to me, but the show itself was good. Great performance, I thought. Obviously, everybody loved the TikTok bangers, but um, the other ones were really good too. So I felt like it was a healthy mix. And they trolled the crowd at the end of the show with being like, all right, here's our encore. I know you guys really wanted this one, like Lover's Rock, because they didn't play it yet. And then they played their um, like Super Jesus-y song off of their new album, which I thought was fucking hilarious. And then they played Lover's Rock after that, but it was, it was good. And all home before 11. I enjoyed watching this. It was definitely a turn of events that I did not see happening or expect to be doing, but I'm glad I went. Like I said, it was worth it to go. So if you think that you don't have anyone to go to a show with or you can't find anybody to go to a show with you and you're nervous to go solo just fucking do it especially if it's somebody you really want to see so with that i hope you have a great fucking weekend and i will see you in the next one bye <laughs> oh let me show you the crew neck first before i go look at this fucking crew neck bright blue too that's what i'm talking about bands Give out more merch that isn't fucking black or skin flesh beige. Okay? That's what I ask. Thank you. Bye for real.